Hello everybody and welcome to a Let's Play from Egos Productions. Today we are playing in MAME. We're going to be doing two-player paused screen apparently. There it goes. Peace. Two-player arcade games. We're starting out with G.I. Joe. Yo. And away we go. Bravery. Ooh, another spread eagle. <laughs> For those of you just joining us. <laughs> You can, almost, you can almost tell if the carpet matched the drapes, couldn't you? You missed the homoeroticism of Cobra Commander. Freedom. Oh, did he do it already? Oh. Yeah, that was Oops. already passed. But it's not all right, right, right. Another restart then. We got to do this oh right. Oh, God. No, Damn comment on it! <laughs> I insist. So, uh, Leafy over there. By the way, introductions, I'm the Everyday Geek. I'm a wannabe host. Leafy Green. And Leafy over there yeah, was just, very kind oh. a couple days ahead of Thanksgiving. We all have events happening with our respective families on Thanksgiving, but he brought over Thanksgiving Terrorist. dinner from Denny's. And Cobra Commander and brought you know us what? butts! That's right! right. <laughs> Your so, butts must be clenched. Thank you for doing that. That was kind. All right, You're welcome. welcome! And... No! Let me think about your butts. We will oh, masturbate. Thinking about butts. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, so let's start the game. <laughs> Wait, it only means one thing. Invasion. Invasion. <laughs> it only means one thing. An attack. For oh, real. me. Okay, I should probably hit All right, who do you want to be? Something like that. Uh, I think I'm going to be Body Musa. Or are you going to be Body Musa? <laughs> no, no, I'll be Duke. Yeah. I want to be Snake Eyes just because he says Yo Joe. And well, then I'm going to be Body Massage. Okay, go for it. <laughs> body Massage. I'll switch to Scarlet later on because we we need to have something to look at. You know what I mean? Yeah, mm. especially in these graphics. Yep. Kilmer Abbey finishes the heavy bomber and it then Cobra spreads their legs of destruction and chaos. Cobra Commander declares, at last I will come. Oh, what? <laughs> Wow. I'm not I'm not speeding these I, up by the way. I didn't even do that. It's first. not my fault this time. Not my uh, fault. Okay, are we playing? Here we go. Yeah. Yes. Your controls work? It's time to yeah. blow up the plane. Get a rapid fire in the middle. Do it. Get oh, the bar. Right. Oh, okay, I go. just hold the button down now. Yep. Yay. Cool. Yeah. Boy, these guys are real pushovers. Yeah, are they good, cobra or something? Suck. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, anybody want a body massage? It's weird body how massage. hard the airborne uh, ones are to hit, though. Uh, body it's very weird. That is very weird. It is so weird that I'm weird. And then out. you don't get points for blowing up the gas containers. It's like, what? Oh, we get points? Oh, that's cool. Well, for <laughs> certain things. The score is ah! kind of low, too. I'm 72, you've got 53. Not those flying like... purple boys. Haha, <laughs> you missed me. Yeah, you know, it's interesting. This is By the way, like, grenades or rockets, whatever. This is yeah. like later G.I. Joe stuff. This is yeah. when their costumes got really funky. This, what, this game came beginning. out in 92, so like... Yeah, it sounds about right. Right near the G. end. G.I. Joe had been out for 10 yeah, years. Yeah, this is right this near is the end. This is when they got their fabulous... Oh, I remember in the 90s, all the toys had like insane colors. Yeah. Because everyone found out how to dye plastics. It all started by He-Man. So. Is that what happened? Something like that happened. <laughs> And also, yeah. I think because everyone's like, well, if it's colored like a toy, no one will mistake it for a gun in some uh, kid's hand, you know? Like, like no one's going to have a weird-ass magenta with orange highlights pistol, you know? Like, orange highlights. Well, and I was, still a, I was still collecting at this time, and so, like, Alley Viper and... Oh, who's that guy? The, the, uh, they had some pretty crazy... Dr. Mindbender? Dr. Mindbender was pretty crazy, but the craziest one was that bird guy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, who was oh, he? Oh, shoot. Uh, oh, I can't remember. Yeah, I can't either. Speaking of bird, I didn't know that was real. What? Bird. The, the, the scooters? What? Oh, yeah, what about them? Oh, yeah. my God. I real? was watching South Park. I didn't know that was real. Oh, I didn't know it was on South Park. I need rapid fire. Oh, behind mm -hmm. on South Park. Yeah, that's the real thing. Hey, it's Tom X and Zamon. What's going on, twins? What'd you call them? Hiya! They're the, uh... Um, Yo, Joe, take this in your nose! Paradox. Double mint twins. <laughs> Double mint twins. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I just got barbecued. Wait, no, I'm Roblox. Ah! So what's, um... They're the palindromic ah! twins. Hey, we, that's hey, what it was. Hey, hey. Go hide behind Snake Eyes. <laughs> no. Ready left. Twins. Ready right. We're dancing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Square yeah. dancing. Ah! Yeah, I got burned. Okay, let me help out now. It looks like ah! he's, it looks like he's saying bottom. Ah! See, watch this. Watch when he pop when he oh you're gonna die. 
it's just one of those things you gotta get used to. By the way, uh, there's an R in there. Pick up those things. Get your rapid fire. There we go. All right, I'm back to rapid fire. Ooh. Let's do some dancing. Ready, left. And don't Ready, let these guys right. land on Ready, your head. Ready, left. Right. <laughs> Synchronized yo jo -ing. Sounds about right. Health. You got the health. Nice. There was health? I didn't even know. Didn't yeah, even every know. now and then a little med kit pops oh! out. Oh, that was me. Oh, man, I'm trying to shoot the tower. I need health, too, because I took a hit earlier, but I'm okay. I'm all right. I'm okay. I'm going to pump my gas someday. When In the arcades, I basically was pissed off if I died before defeating Baroness. So, like, wow. that might not happen this time, but... Then yeah. Destro's, Destro's kind of impossible. Like, In the arcades, I didn't play because I didn't have enough money to play because I would just die all the time. Well, how do you think we got that good? Just by spending $85 on... <laughs> right. Like, you think games are more expensive now. Like, oh man, that thing's like 60 bucks on pre-order. It was like, uh, ever play an arcade game? <laughs> right. Like a roll of quarters goes in no time. Tell you about a roll of quarters Ooh. in my pants. That's not a roll. But then again, it's like after you get good enough at certain games, like I used to play like, you know, Raiden for like 40 minutes on a quarter typically. So wow, like, that's impressive. you know, eventually it's like, yeah, you know, give me a couple quarters, zone. I'm good all day. You know? All I do in this game is die. That's okay. Die, die. Well, it's really too bad yeah, this isn't on an emulator where you can die. Oh, I got hit. Now I got to watch out. I might be pissed off if I die. Ah! Where's my green Check out thing? that laser Ah, the stupid almonds are coming at me. Oh, it got me! <laughs> you know, those blue diamond people really need to settle down. They're they almonds. Do. Almond attack. Almond attack. <laughs> Almond attack. Almond attack. Sounds kind of as Tekken when you say it like that. <laughs> Yeah, we both need rapid so that we can stop clicking our buttons, oh. so to speak. Yeah. There oh, we go, rapid for each of us. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. There are going to be a ton. They're, they're going to get the health. Thanks. Cool. Uh, you're welcome. What happened? No, there was a health there, so I wanted to get it. I mean, I, yeah, I there was, was. I was lower than you, so. Uh, I, where, we, we have health? I... Yeah, you can take, like, two hits before you die. Really? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Glad to know that. So now. third hit kills you. It's three strikes are out. Yeah. Gotcha. It's like it's like California. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, metalhead coming up. And then the screwed up graphics level. Which isn't screwed up anymore. I hope the sound of the game is loud enough. I think I'm gonna crank it a little bit more. Yo Joe. Crank it. Head. Crank, crank, crank it up. Oh, there's crank, your crank, crank, crank. rapid. Oh, 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 yes. I'm rapid. I'm rapidly rapid. Rapping Rodney. Don't get no respect. No, no. That takes you back to the 80s, right? Yeah. Rapping Rodney. <laughs> Boy, these guys are kind of useless, man. We're just, like, shooting them all. They're hardly firing back. They're like... I'm gonna throw an almond at you. <laughs> uh, do I want to continue? Yeah. All right. Oh, um, do we still have credits? Yeah. Okay. If you need more credits to say, so I have the button for it. Ooh. Actually, so there. much better than the '80s, where you <laughs> actually had to have, you know, money. We're powered up with a whole bunch of continues now. Oh, we double missiled him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, how do you like that? We Eiffel Towered your... Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. I don't think that's, so bad. that's about where I draw the line. <laughs> we were just talking about what? The Triceratops? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at the Triceratops, you metalhead. Oh, oh, damn. Oh. Okay, they're actually firing enough to make me nervous. That's... Have you died yet? Look, he's kind of, he's kind of blinking red, so that means he's, uh, oh, have I died yet? Yeah. No. It's hilarious, because I've died, like, three times. I've taken two hits, and I healed back one with the, uh, oh, now I've taken three hits. My bad. 
He's blinking. I moved. I moved too quick. I thought that explosion was done, but I ran right into it. Oh! You just like ran right at that. Like, <laughs> yes, like, wait, wait! You're gonna miss. I can't <laughs> like, dodge anything. There he goes. Finally. Oh, look! He's spread eagle on the ground. That's that's what that's this the game usual does. Position. <laughs> What's kind of awesome okay. is sometimes when the thing blows up, his body flies at the camera, and he's screaming like, "Ah!" It's going like. Oh. Oh. I have to be careful because one hit and I'm, you know, my I die. Basically. Oh, and then you have to hit the re. Save yeah, I know. Again. It's a big deal, isn't it? Uh, but I like so to know, you know I'm doing works. well compared to how I normally play. You know. You shoot these enough, they collapse, and will often take guys out. And these park things that, like, look at all the rockets that come out. So you can, like, rocket platforms and then collect. Like, right now I'm at 9, so pick up some rockets when you get a chance, because uh, I'm maxed. You might even say I'm toe-maxed. Oh. <laughs> and Zabonted. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll use some rockets to get us out here. Shoot this thing, and then it'll... There we go. All the laser vipers died before they could shoot us. Oh, that's nice. Yep. Oh, I got almond. Shoot this platform, too, if you can. <laughs> uh, no, 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 no worries. I got it. There we go. Rapid fire. All right, you got it. Bang Mark 2! Oh, crap. Crap! Almond! Dang! That was a big cluster right there. They were firing every which way. Kind of all looks the same to me. The graphics in this game are kind of messy. Oh, guy's gonna jump on you! <laughs> rapid fire! And I died. Right after picking up rapid fire. Poop. Alright, it's the Baroness. And I died already, so... I told you I wasn't playing very well tonight. Hey, baby. What do you want? So this is the part where the graphics are messed up. They're supposed to be ground there. But in the emulator, it just doesn't show. Ground where? In front of us. Where all those robot things are. So what's it showing instead? Just the background. Like the background of the building structure. Oh, I see. Okay. Like it should look like a gray plane descending into the background, oh. with these guys popping out of it. So it's a little screwed up. Why is there a building? That's weird. Huh? Well, that's like the background. Remember we're on the lift going up. That's right. just the background for it. So. Yeah, this guy in the background shoots some big shots at you, so be on the lookout for them. You see, like, a giant orange thing coming at you like Big that? Big shots, little shots. See, look, there's one freaking almond. Well, they throw, some of them throw almonds at you, and this guy shoots, like, the sun at you, so, you know. It, yeah, like I said, it's... Rapid, rapid, same. come get your rapids. Oh, yeah, thanks. Before I hit them accidentally. <laughs> Alright, I'll try to clear... Actually, you know what? Take care of this guy, I'll try to clear these robots, because they... They're a pain when they start rushing you. Watch out for the sun. <laughs> you almost got Capri sunned, oh. my friend. The sun is such a massive incandescent gas. I know, huh? It's a kind of a oh. gas hole, if you will. Oh, I got sunned! <laughs> you got served, son. Or you got sun served, or something. Rapid. Hey, you're you're a babe now. How That's you doing? That's right. What's your sign? Is it like Megan Trainer? No. No, it's neon. <laughs> My, what colorful spandex you wear. Why, I think. Yeah, that's right, Baroness. Be kicking your butt. Yeah! That's what I say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, baby. What's Yo, going on? Yeah. That's a little weird, Joey. <laughs> G.I. J. Oh, <laughs> cool. That was just mission one. Cool. Cobra Commander threatens to... G.I. Joe comes to the best to discover the secret military base of the launch missiles. 
Yeah. G.I. Joe discovers that the Dick and Tide covers oh. space as part of the deepest part in the part of the jungle. <laughs> the, I'm not even no skipping joke. these. This is the final <laughs> yeah. battle of the yay. Hey, it's time for the G.I. Joe rap song. Go. 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 Oh, I should probably shoot. Probably. You, you actually ran really hard to miss picking up that rocket. You know that, Joe? Well, uh, I don't even know what's going on. Ah! Ah, guy's gonna... <laughs> I keep hitting trees. These guys apparently never were trained out to fire their weapons because they just want to charge and hit you. See? Well, it does kind of work against me. <laughs> <laughs> They're still suffering severe losses, but yeah, yeah, they do eventually kill Scarlet. The trees, all the humanity. <laughs> it's kind of cool, though, the guys who are hiding in the trees. If you knock the tree down, it kills them. So that's kind of neat. That's that's just family entertainment right there. <laughs> Knocking down the trees to kill people. Yeah, knocking it? the trees like, yeah. Oh, whoa. I got hit again. Those stupid popoid tanks, man. <laughs> yeah. You like how I'm like, no, they're not yours, Joey. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, you came over for the rapid, and I'm like, eh, I think that one's mine. Oh. There should be rapid it. popping oh, no, out here. There we go. Rapid. Uh, too late. Rapid up there. Oh, right, wait, I man. shot it by mistake. Uh, wait, Sorry. I got it. Wait, there will be rapids up here for both of us. Yeah, you got one. Cool. There we go. Nice and rapids. Tanks! Tanks! You're welcome. Oh! Oh, almonds! Uh, I died again. I gotta continue. So since Snake Eyes is officially dead and you killed Roadblock, I guess I'm gonna be Duke. Oh, and you killed Scarlet too, so now I'm the only okay, one left. Yeah. <laughs> I've come back so many times. We have to be double Dukes, maybe. Double Dukes. Hmm. Those are some nice pants. Are they Double Dukes? Ha <laughs> ha. Ha. I see what you did there. <laughs> Watch out ah! for the falling tree. Oh my god. Ah, timber! Hey. Right. Oh, Jabba You know, even for its time, I guess this game does kind of look like ass. But, oh well. It's still fun. I, oh. I expect that metal eyeball to come out any second. Fire. Oh, crap. Another thing, too, is on analog screens, on CRTs, the edges of pixelated graphics were, like, kind of anti-aliased. So, like, a lot of these games look better if you have, like, a real TV to look at, like, a CRT to look at them on. Yeah, what he said. Uh-huh. Well, like, LCDs are too precise, basically. I see. For something this low res. Uh, we need to get some uh, rapid fires here. I've always wondered too, like, is it more effective to shoot Major Blood or the Terror Drum during that part? I don't know if it even makes a difference. Maybe there's a game fact somewhere that explains. Oh, what are you doing to me, dude? Oh, yeah. You. What? Oh, I'm oh, on yeah. top. Oh, yeah, dude. Thank you. Now the terror drone got me. Well, you know, at least that's not the worst way to go. It's not that embarrassing. I got taken out by a giant structure that shoots, you know, balls of fire at people. Goodness like, gracious. <laughs> I forgot I had rapid, so I, I was still tapping. It's my desire. I think I, I continued to tap because Scarlet was around. Yeah. Oh, high voltage! What? <laughs> what Kale said. Oh, that's coming for you, Snakies! Alright, he dodged. Oh, crap! <laughs> I decided to run across at kind of a bad time. <laughs> oh, my God, fire! Oh, my God, there's a fire in the disco! It's my desire! Fire in the Taco Bell! <laughs> wow. I think you guys made that song even gayer than the Time Warp. So hard. Do the again. <laughs> I died again. It's not fair. It's not fair. It's supposed to be better than that. Earthquake. What kind of a delay do we have on the stream here? Looks like it's a bit. 
Yeah, thanks for staying there, guys. That helped a lot. Man. Ninja! Ninja! Thanks, thanks for Dead. not shooting. <laughs> and all these guys, thanks for not shooting. Thank you, thank you. There's rapid fire! Rapid fire! Here's where you can just fill up on all the rockets. So all these guys pop them out. Look out for the bats. Remember those guys? They were like squeak, androids. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Oh, androids. Yeah. Oh, they hit me. Oh, oh, I'm doing so bad. Watch out. Oh, green lasers. Ah, oh, bats. Oh, 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 it almost got me. Hey, in some spots on this cavern, you can shoot down the stalactites and they land on it's guys. very dark in here. Or stalagmites or whatever. Bomb! <laughs> it's a good spot for it. So, like, yeah, you can, like, make these land on guys and, like, knock over the columns and it'll, like, smash tanks and stuff. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I'm just giving some pointers. Rapid. Let's try to destroy this thing before we're too close, because it, it can collapse on you. Like, oh! I almost got knocked there. Well, I did. It's I think we have enough continues. But I think we'll make it. Is it your design? Oh! I picked up the rapid. Sorry. There's one. Yeah, you can. In here, you can get the columns to like domino effect. Uh, we kind of missed it, I guess. Domino? Laser Vipers! Yeah! I'm starting to think it sounds like I have Tourette's when I just shout things out like, Laser Vipers! <laughs> okay, this guy, don't blow him up too close to us, because uh, it'll fall on us. Like, now is good. <laughs> Alright. Cool. You, you timed that pretty much perfectly. Uh, yeah, that was uh, just like a plan. Yep. <laughs> Rapid. Ah! Grenades. I'm, Everything. I'm actually starting to get to the point where I can see an almond coming at me. Not nice. the big neon green ninjas, mind you. Right. It's the uh, almonds. The stuff that doesn't stand out is what you're paying attention to. Yeah. Apparently. Uh oh, bats. It, yeah. <laughs> bats. Oh, I got hit again. Jerky. Now I gotta click to fire. How, how stupid is that, huh? Stupid. Uh, I don't, okay, I don't even know what hit me right there. I had my eyes on a different part of the screen. Oh! I got killed by the alley vipers. No way! Yeah, way. That'll make Jason so happy. I know, huh? Those guys with the South African camo colors. What? <laughs> come here, come here. Oh, and this part's supposed to be water. You see, this is messed up too. That's like, so weird. <laughs> it's a sand tank. Apparently. I am Destro. You will worship my butt. Man, Destro is. Oh, when this game in. starts getting hard. What starts getting hard? <laughs> well, I mean, like, even if you're experienced, it's still pretty hard. Oh, I guess like I, like Baroness uh, is a cakewalk compared to this guy. Uh, let's see. I guess I got nowhere to go but up. Oh crap! That was crazy. I just weaved between multiple shots and thought it so I was so had. No, it's because like Destro and then the final boss, Cobra Commander, they fire all across the screen at certain points, and it's like almost impossible to not get hit. So. So that's when it becomes, like, really hard.
And then on this part, you gotta watch for the, uh... It's not the water moccasin, but the other... What was the ship Cobra had later? It was like a hydrofoil. That thing, you see the hydrofoil in the background? It was the hydrofoil. These guys freaking mess you up if you let them... Like, you see? That one cut in and hit me. Like, ugh. You gotta be, like, on guard for the hydrofoils. So if you let them come into the screen, you're kind of done. Are you sure that's water? It looks like sand. It, it sure does. Sand. See? Hydrofoil. That's what they do when they get into the screen. They come out of the background when you're least expecting it. No one expects the hydrofoil yeah. in position. <laughs> And we haven't even gotten to, like, Destro ah, himself yet. Oh! That's what got me? Saying. Oh, well. I'm starting to say that a lot now. <laughs> what got me? I think it was the rockets that got me that time. Cobra! Oh, oh now that guy strafed me? Cobra! Cobra! And that wasn't annoying. Body <laughs> Body oh, gosh. Hydrofoil! Kill him! Kill him! Alright. There he is. Yeah, try to dodge his shots. Okay. Oh god. <laughs> I have a teleporter. Oh, shh. Damn. I will shoot you. Hey! Wow. Totally screwing up. Body massage? Body massage. Yes, your needs. Body massage. Yeah, we both ate it there. Wow. I keep killing you and you keep coming back. I think I've kind of lost track of how many times this I continued. Body massage. Uh, I lost track how many times I continued in the first five minutes. I'm pretty sure this game has cost me about a dollar so far. So. I'm probably to about a hundred. You had to take out a second mortgage. Oh my god! That's what, it's they, a that's what these simulators should do: is keep track of how much you pay. Right. Because that's the real. There might be something in the UI that does track that, but they oh, wouldn't really be able to do it in here because this is running the arcade code. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it'd have to be like an overlay. The commander launches the battleship to the world. The final battle. It's the final battle! <laughs> Good job! And that pose with Cobra Commander with the ship in front of him didn't look phallic at all. No, no. Just saying. By the way, we were on like the G.I. Joe version of the Nighthawk there, right? The one that was painted white. Oh, uh, I guess. I thought it was a weird sky striker, but I think you're probably right. Yeah, it's the one that kind of resembles the uh, SR-71. Yeah. The, um... I had that. It was the uh, Ghost something. Oh, really? Oh. I had the Nighthawk. That one oh, was... Yeah, that's, that's one of the best G.I. Joe toys, no, I think. you're right. It's, no, I'm thinking something else. There is another one. But it's not the one. At least it wasn't Tiger Force. <laughs> Tiger Force. Can you imagine Tiger Force with these graphics? Like, oh god, I can't make it out. What is it? Battle Force 2000. Oh, the Force of G.I. Joe. You know, that was when G.I. Joe started losing me. Battle I thought Battle Force, Force 2000, 2000 was the worst. Gonna get G.I. Joe. Like, even in the Are comics, they were stupid. Like, <laughs> G.I. Joe. I remember the 90s, you put 2000 in front of anything. It was, you know, future. Right? Cool. And everything was extreme. Yeah. Extreme Force 2000. And Cobra. Oh, what was that? Oh well. Cobra. La, 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 la. Is that what you're doing? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, you know, I totally dodge these things better when I'm like blinking. <laughs> yeah, like don't look at it. Just. No, I mean when my character's like blinking, like right now, oh, oh. Like, nothing can touch me. Yeah, well, that's because nothing can touch you. Yeah, that's right. That's... <laughs> I thought you meant when you were blinking your eyes, like you were uh, using some yeah. kind of. Yeah, yeah. That wouldn't make any difference. You were using your daredevil power. <laughs> oh. 
Like I can sense the pixels in my mind. <laughs> and tell the heartbeat of the emulator. Hey, who's this? We are this, now in This the can't be Cobra darkness. Commander. Hey, I don't know. I up? think I think that's an imposter. Wait, who is this? Go away! I don't want to. Did you hear his voice? He's all he's got a deep voice in this game. I, I say, where's continuity if you can't match the character voices? <laughs> that is true. And if Snake Eyes <gasps> says, yo, Joe, you know, what, what's up with that? I think it's the audio guy was messed up on this, because the visuals are actually pretty accurate. Right. It's probably they just couldn't get the... They couldn't afford the voice actors or anyone who sounded appropriate enough, so... Electricity. Electricity. Oh no! Oh no! High voltage. Okay, here we go. I don't know about this Cobra Commander guy. He seems so funny. Oh, both of us. Scarlet's gonna show you a thing or two. Yeah, it's nice to have rockets again. Jeez. You cannot hurt oh. me while I'm in this pink fog. <laughs> you mean force field? <laughs> Body massage. No, it's my special pink fog. Pink fog. Pink fog activated. I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, like, Galoob made that or something. Pink fog. Hi, Galoob. <laughs> oh, that, you got scoped. Now you're getting my twisty balls of fire. Rapid. <laughs> Just in case, uh, yeah. survive five seconds. Yeah, not going to happen. Oh, look. <laughs> One, two, Hey, wait three, a second. Four, five. I I'm him for five bringing seconds. down my pink fog. Oh. You really pissed me off. Take that electricity. High voltage. Yeah, take the fireball. What exactly are we doing? Oh, we defeated him. Woo! <laughs> bye bye. Co what? <laughs> hey, I'm dead. That's no fair. He was a robot. Oh. Oh. Did that instead. <laughs> <laughs> Is this really him? Cause... I, God, I hope so. <laughs> oh boy. He's gonna shoot. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Body massage. Body massage. Body massage. You know what I also don't like about this? They don't have, um... Like, I don't know what his health is. True. My health is fine, thank you very much. Huh. That's okay, though. He They blink when they're getting close to dead. Oh, yeah. well, I don't know when to give him a body massage. <laughs> you mean you need his health to be low to give him a body massage? <laughs> what yeah, kind of place are you running? Me. That's right, I stood in the middle of that crap. That's right. I have no rockets, so... Uh, hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Take that. You see what I mean about his shots? Like, he Ooh, fires, like, all more. over the place. Great balls of fire! Did oh god, it? oh god. <laughs> oh shoot! Ah! What the heck was that? <laughs> oh well, he got me. It's a body oh! Oh, he got Four me again. That was tricky. Fire. Oh gosh. Oh my goodness. Almonds for oh, Jesus. everybody! <laughs> ah! No, don't shoot then this you way. Then you get an almond. Then you get an almond. Then you get some exploding fire. Then so do you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy shots. Almonds for everybody. Oh gosh. Hey, that was a well-timed rocket. I think you saved me. You're welcome. Nice job. See how much he's blinking? That means his health is low. Ah, oh, we're gonna See? win. Hey! Gonna bring, the, bring it! Ah! All we had to do is push him over the edge. Maybe we should have done that to begin with. Well, he kind of <laughs> fell into a giant explosion. So. <laughs> Unless this is a comic book or a t or a cartoon or something. Wait, we're oh, on that ship. <laughs> my penis is going. I mean, my phallic. I mean, my ship is going down. It's going into the deeper jungle. <laughs> <laughs> push, mm. push in the bush. Hey! Oh, my face! Oh, ooh, ow! Yeah, oh. Gi Oh. Well, that was a game. <laughs> All right, it's late. I gotta get going, but that was what? Like wow, you're not gonna play another game? It's o like only GI Joe. All oh, right. Well, I could. Well, what's the other game? I, mean, I think we should make Kale play one. <laughs> or, or I could do Raiden by myself. 
I'll be like Cobra Commander. Or you, you want to join in? No? no, no, I'm too tired. Sure. Oh man. I, See, I, I shouldn't I, have I said. Not, I, I shouldn't have said Raiden by myself because now I guess that's what's going to happen. Now you have to do it. Yeah, and I will not be an asset to you on Raiden. Yeah, you all. will. You'll you'll absorb shots for me. <laughs> Actually, I think I need to uh, ignore the million point challenge too. That's a recycled graphic in the corner. This is not a mil Actually, though, I might try for a million points in Raiden too. You should try that. Mm. Oh, it's it's not that easy out. to do. So, bye everybody. Thank you for joining, Daryl. Yeah. Oh, bye. Yeah. Okay, I'll me. I'm gonna go, but he's gonna do a million points. Or I guess that okay. sounds about right. Okay, bye. Thank you for joining us. You're welcome. Mister. It was entertaining. We Bye -bye. will see you next time. Take some pumpkin pie. Oh, I probably And this is one of those games oh, that's stuff. upright. All your stuff. Upright. Can you get it? You need me to lift up for I you? need you to lift. Alright. This could use some adjustment. Lift it up. And your computer. Oh, that's important. Yep. Hey, Jeffar. All right, let's do that. Boom. Okay. So this is, I guess, Raiden Million Point Challenge 1. <laughs> Wait. Huh? Couldn't it be 3? No, because that was a different game. That this was, is was, Raiden uh, 2. Twin Cobra I was doing oh. Million Point Challenge. So I think I have to set up uh, my controls for this. Well, good luck Probably. on your million points. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. That oh, looks like I'm actually set up. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, see you next week. Probably. All right. Bye. See ya. Thanks for coming. Have a good Thanksgiving. You're welcome. Happy pre-Thanksgiving. So I don't know. I guess the simple way to do this is I'll steal Joey's controller. Because I like playing as player two on this game. Mm. You when get, you're playing Raiden 2? You get different bombs as your default. And I like these bombs because they can save your bacon faster than the player one bombs. Mm. And I mean, I could software configure it so that I'm inputting on player two or whatever, but it's like, yeah, we've already got the other stick here. So why do it? That's what she said. I'm sure this is going to be fascinating for you to watch, Kale. Yes, of course. Fascinating. <laughs> but you know what, though, I'm not. I'm not against you know talking about various topics while we're you know this doesn't have to be just a <laughs> let's play. We could talk about our damn books we read and stuff. Ah, now that Joey's gone, <laughs> we can talk about I Am Legend. Neville, come out, Neville! I'm going to. Kick your, I mean, kick your, Whoa, I mean, suck hey. your, I mean, oh, dang. come out, devil, is, god damn it! This is live on Twitch. <laughs> we don't need another Gary Coleman incident. <laughs> you know it makes it twice as worse every time you say it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like saying that name in the mirror, you know? Right. <laughs> All right, let me fix a minor thing because there's no more player two. <laughs> Yeah. Was that Michael Jackson leaving the building? Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, I think I'm set up to play this. Mm -hmm. Or not. There we go. Oh! I'm... Alright. Are you player <sighs> two? Yeah, I... Hold on. It would give me an unfair point advantage to have the player one ship show up because more power-ups mm. come out so what i need to do is disable his uh his button stick. let's see so i think it'd be under uh, other controls let's see coin drop will be either stick and then yeah that should actually do it i think okay We'll just let everyone die here.
So as a little note, the last time I was playing Raiden, I was playing a slightly different ROM version of it. Mm. This version resembles the version that was released mm. on the PlayStation as the Raiden project. And I just kind of like the balancing of this one a little bit better. But I don't know which uh, version is actually like officially the like latest one or whatever. Mm. But like enemies are in a different spot. Some of the weapons damage is different balanced. So, uh, but I, this, this version is probably slightly easier, but I kind of prefer, um, that like the other version I was playing, the red laser that spreads out, it like kind of tickles your enemies, you know, on this one, it can actually do some damage. So I kind of like starting out with the red laser, then I'll go to the purple. But interestingly, in this version, the purple does less damage than in the other version. So like I said, the balancing is a little bit different. Hmm. I'm going to turbo my fire. It's kind of weird because when competitors go for high scores on this kind of game in like Japan, they actually use rapid fire. And I, I don't think that's true to the like intent of the original design, but I'm going to do it for now because you're trying to get it'll be my little crutch. Yeah. But I think if you're really competing, they shouldn't allow rapid fire. That's external to the game. Like, if the game has built in rapid right. fire, then so be it. You know. But whatever. I'm going to use it. Oh, I'm not using. Okay. Well, this is the version I played before, not the updated one. So I guess I'll start on this one, see how I do, then I'll switch to the other one. I loaded the wrong ROM, so. Mm. Oh, well. I guess the red doesn't do too bad against guys on this. I just think against the bosses, it's like really hard to destroy them with the red. It just takes so many shots. Hmm. Hmm. He says. Hmm. And in this version, I probably should have gotten the uh, straightforward missiles instead of the homing rockets. Because in this version, the homing does not much damage. The other version, they changed the balance, like, the straight rockets do a lot of damage in this version, and they're barely more powerful than the homing rockets on the other version. It's kind of weird. And I don't think I'm going to get this. Okay, I got the fairy. Whew. Barely. Barely. Yeah, so I haven't played this version for a while, so I'm, I might get surprised by some enemies that pop out where I'm not expecting them. <laughs> I mean, it's not a huge remix, but yeah, every now and then there's like a tank or something that comes out somewhere and that doesn't in the other version. So my question now is maybe to take out the boss, I should just get, I'll switch missiles to forward firing. Then you can spam the bad guy, the main boss, by doing this. Because the missiles come out so fast. Spanking. Bam! See? Yep. Banked. That was fast. Boss one defeated. And there's another one just like it. Ooh, wow, I barely got there in time. I was dividing my attention between trying to destroy the little guy and getting on top of this dude when he fires. I almost messed it up. Yeah, so I think getting the forward firing missiles was a good choice here. Uh, there's the secret. Okay. What's my bonus look like? 52,000? That's about the best I think you can do in single player. I don't know. Maybe. Are you gonna fall asleep? <laughs> no. Leafy, Leafy is just. He's, uh. He worked all day. He slaved fixing, uh, Denny's turkey dinners for everyone. <laughs> and. That was it. Yeah. Over the hot stove. It really got me. <laughs> I 
I'm sure there was some comment that would work there, but I didn't figure it out in time. You weren't distracted. Were you? Oh, these guys kind of... Wow. Second level already. Boo. Take that with my special whip. <laughs> All right, well... It's a rough start for getting to a million, I'll tell you what. But I'm not really bothered because this isn't the version I was intending to play. So, you know. Because mm -hmm. I'm well practiced in the other version. We'll try that next. These guys, too, man. Like, ugh. the firing pattern on them. Eesh. And then you've got other tanks firing at you while this guy's trying to kill you. It's so much fun. Yeah, so this version of the game, I should have just started with purple laser. But, whatever. Purple laser is actually stronger in this version than the other one. So, hmm. weird. <clears throat> And then the straight missiles are, like, devastating in this version. It, they seem like they're, like, half-powered on the other version. It's kind of weird. Hmm. So the other version I use, homing missiles, because they're, they're really not that much weaker. And they're, they hit a lot more stuff, you know. Because <laughs> they home in on things, so... Okay, let's see, we got that. There's gonna be a guy popping out here. Nope, not this version. Okay. My purple laser's getting bigger all the time. Look at that. And even bigger. Uh oh. Tanky over here is gonna be a problem. There we go. Whew. All right. I think these missiles are powerful enough. I should hopefully hose this guy pretty quick. Well, I'm going to try this high score way. No bombs. Wish me luck. Yeah. <laughs> oh, golly. That, those are, I think those shots are faster than in the other version. <laughs> and there we go. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, come on now. Wow, this guy's resilient in this version. I thought he'd be dead by now. There we go. Whee. That was a lot of shot dodging. So anyway, that's kind of the cool thing about practicing this game again over the last few months, is that, like, I know the last time I live-streamed this game, I was all like, God, I feel like I'm so lethargic. Like, I see a shot I want to dodge, and my mind doesn't know what to do right away. And now it's like, it's just this fluid thing. You know, like, I'm kind of back to where I was... Back in the day, not quite as good, but, mm. you know, like, it feels like I'm not stressing about, like, oh, is this thing going to shoot at me from the side or whatever? It's like, well, if it does, I'll just dodge it. You know, like, yeah, eh. <laughs> it doesn't always work, but, you know, I'm going to switch to homing. <clears throat> that should help. Because now we get guys that come flying pretty far down the screen and you want to have your homing missiles take them out. And... Oof. That one tank from the side almost got me. One that shoots the white shots. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm, I've passed half a million on the wrong version of the game. <laughs> so it's... I, I gotta say I'm pleased with that if I even don't do much better. Like, considering this isn't the one I wanted to do. I was actually kind of wondering to myself, like, how much worse I would do if I played this version again, because it is a slight bit harder. 
the ROM name for the other version that I want to play, it's called the easy version, but like, it's not easy. It's just like a hair less hard than this one, you know? Mm. <laughs> like, calling it easy is kind of like silly. Right. You know? But I get what they're saying. It's like, maybe. I think that version might be the later one, and it's just tuned a little bit better. Mm. And because it's tuned better, it is kind of easier, you know? Because they got the balance right between the damage of the weapons and whatnot. Right. Anyway, there we go. So, yeah, even though I said, yeah, like, how far did I make it after I said, gee, I'm quite pleased how far I've gone. Like, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Let's get the right version that I'm looking for. Hmm. Easy version US set 2. This is it. Okay. I just have to check that. Uh, well, you know what? Instead of checking it, let's just see if it works. Yep. Second player. Okay, this is the one. Really trying for a million. <clears throat> Feeling pretty good about it. I'm going to start out with... Um, well, I'm basically going to play homing missiles the entire game. Start out with the red spread laser. And then uh, transition to purple, like, uh, just before the second level boss. I think I just picked up purple. What am I? All right, I guess I'm playing purple. <laughs> Oops. I was, like, on autopilot or something. I'm like, oh, look, purple. I'll pick that up. Yeah, whatever. Purple it is. I can make it work. A couple guys are kind of hard to destroy. Like, you see how long it takes to blow someone up with the purple? Yeah, on this version. In that version so like the first couple levels when you're not full power, it, purple's kind of difficult because especially the bosses, man, like, woof. Red can tear through them pretty quick. Maybe I should just switch back to red. I don't know. That's going to be... Basically, if you switch back and forth like that, you're going to not progress as fast because... When you switch colors, you don't progress up a level. Like, you see, like, I went to red, and now I'm, like, default laser strength. So, basically, I've picked up two power-ups and haven't progressed. So, mm -hmm. I sacrificed those. But it's probably worth it, though. Like, I'll just have to suck it up and, you know, be lower power for a while. Though, getting this uh, fairy might be hard with weapons this week. Okay, we got it. I already started off on the wrong foot. Thank you very much. So, I don't know, Kale, does this look massively easier to you? Nope. <laughs> yeah. Like, there are subtle things that I actually think are easier, but it's like, you know, 90% as hard as the other one, so, like, it's not a big deal. And the fact that, like, the red lasers and the uh, the homing missiles actually do pretty good damage is actually a pretty big boon in this version, especially in the early levels. Can I get that metal? I think I missed it. All right, I'm restarting. <laughs> I picked up the wrong power-up. I was screwing up picking up all the metals. That's not a good way to get your million points, just saying. All right, take two. I needed more coffee. That's what it was. Hmm. And we're off. No, I got it this time. But I got to remember, pick up red. Red only. <laughs> yeah, got to be in the right mindset here. Okay. All right, I've got 420 points. Well on my way to a million, I tell you. Are you sure you don't want to join in here, Leafy? I'm sure. It's two players pretty fun. I'm sure. <laughs> You don't want to blow everybody up. 
Uh, I know what it is. You can't destroy the trees in this game, so you're just like, that screw has that. offended me greatly, yeah. Because <laughs> you're like, I'm not playing any game. You can't destroy the trees. Right. That's the way to kill that guy. Just rush him. I boycott games that kill trees. Games that don't kill trees? No, games that kill trees. What? I boycott. No, we're. We're playing it funny style by saying you won't play a game you can't destroy the trees. But you can destroy the trees. In this? Yeah. Isn't, well, isn't... the enemies... Oh, no, that's the other game. Yeah. The enemies sometimes hit the trees after you knock them out of the air in well, this game. Well, that's good enough. But... I won't play that. Then. Okay. Yeah. On those grounds. Yes, on those grounds. Oh, you can blow up this tree, though. See, I forgot about that. There's a fairy ex... tree. That's not acceptable. You shoot a tree until a fairy comes out. Let's but see. it doesn't... You see the tree's still there, though, so it didn't destroy it. So are you technically shooting the fairy? Mm. Are you okay with shooting fairies but not trees? See, I'm not prejudiced against fairies, but I will shoot them. Fairy lives matter? <laughs> <laughs> God. No, that wasn't bright. I don't know if fairy you ever saw that. Fairy lives matter. Did you see that? Bright? On Netflix? Yeah. Oh, I did, yeah. Yeah. Will well, Smith says it. I but I thought it was good. I'm, yeah. I'm real, I was really hoping they'll do another season. It wasn't really a show, though. It was more like a movie, right? It was a movie, yes. Yeah. But so I don't know if the season is the right... Like I was a sequel. hoping they were going to do a, you know, another one. Yeah. Okay, so this time, I've got the right strength of laser. And I have enough time to get down and get the uh, metal without getting shot by the tank. Hey, thanks. See? See how things go when you actually do it right from the beginning? Yeah. So farting around, picking up the purple when you're not meant to? Ugh. I'm telling you, man. See how he's destroying the trees, though? That's yeah, but I'm stopping him. That's so what I'm you saying. You see what I mean? Yeah, like, I'm you, protecting you, the trees. He's doing that. But, you know... He's just not dying fast enough for me to save all the trees and houses. Okay, but I think that's your fault. Oh, it is? Okay. Well, sorry, I'm not, like, superhuman. Yeah. Even though well, I'm kind of superhuman. You need to get there faster. I mean, look at this firepower this thing has. It. I don't know what hammer space all those rockets are coming out from, but, hmm. you know. This thing deploys from the airfield with 58,000 missiles. <laughs> you just never run out. That tank that comes out from the side there, you didn't really see him because I blew him up as soon as he hit the screen. But he's annoying because if you're down too low, he'll get a shot off before he's destroyed, and then, you know, if you're not ready for it, it'll kill you. Right. So, like, some of these, this version, one of the things that is actually a little harder about it is some of these guys shoot earlier like if they're coming out from cover or if they're coming from the side of the screen they just like they're barely on the screen and they're shooting already right but the shots are actually a little bit slower so mm. you know go figure it's like a balancing thing you know like i just after playing both versions a lot i just kind of like the balancing in this one better so and it's not necessarily that much easier but but I like the idea that, like, all the weapons are kind of viable in this version, where the other version, like, the red lasers are just, like, too weak, you know? Mm hmm And arguably the purple is maybe a little too weak in this version, but later on, if you can switch to it when you're max power, you, um, you can do pretty good. Oh, shoot. I almost got caught in the crossfire there. <laughs> this happened last time I streamed this too I don't think on my display I'm getting the full frame rate of the game but on the stream it's fine it's like silky smooth on the stream mm. damn it that was not good that was not part of the plan to get to a million points right there <laughs> Oh, purple. Okay, well, I guess I'll switch to purple now. You can switch to red. Right Too there. late. Yeah, but you don't advance. Oh, the, that's right. Yeah. So I'm like, 
It's not worth switching back at this point, because I was going to switch to purple soon anyway. I was just hoping to be a little stronger before I got there. And this guy's going to come back. What a foo! Oh, crap. <sighs> that was not good. Well, the game's falling apart, people. <laughs> Not even at a quarter million yet, and... Whew. See, it's when I'm not on the spot I can do really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see? Yeah, that's a big And right now I'm complaining about the frame rate on my monitor, because it's... It's lagging a little bit. I find that really weird, though, that... You know, like, on my local computer, it's slightly jumpy but then in the stream it's perfect and like last time i was playing it i was complaining about how jumpy it was but all everyone at home was seeing was perfectly smooth gameplay mm. like like i didn't even know it was smooth on the stream until after the fact and i looked at it I'm like what although it's not bad like i don't think it's actually affecting my my uh play right now it's only dropping the occasional frame so it's just the time before, it was like at like half frame rate part of the time. It was really weird. Okay, well... Oh, oh, okay, shoot. <laughs> it's really close. Uh... Come on, die already. Jeez. I know I don't have very powerful weapons right now, but come on. Come on, work with me here. <laughs> well, hey, it ain't over. It ain't over till it's over. Mm. I could still get to the million. You never know. You never know. 383. It is kind of funny, though, that I did better on the version of the game I didn't practice on. Right. How'd that happen? The yeah. one that's supposedly that's harder. <laughs> and the one I'm not used to at this point is very strange. So I don't know, probably before the end of this level I should transition to purple because the boss on level 3 here is like really tough with red lasers. He has like a lot of little fiddly bits that shoot random directions mm -hmm. and if you if you have the purple you can damage all of them at the same time right so eh, okay purple it is let's do this oh shoot that was almost our game right there <laughs> then i missed one of the medallions over here so that's going to affect my score at the end of the level i saw that shot when it was like a quarter inch from my ship <laughs> I'm like, where'd that shot come from? Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Going for another one, aren't we? Yep. All right. Ah. Do it. I'm telling you, this is the one. This is the I one. I mean, I kid you not, the last time I practiced, I, without continuing, I made it past level five and had like, a million three hundred thousand points or something like and then this happens when i do it live right mm -hmm. <sighs> oh well whatever <laughs> it's like the olympics you train your entire life then you get on the air and fall on your ass it's like that it's exactly like that i am an olympic athlete <laughs> yeah i couldn't even not snort for that one <laughs> Come on, this is the sorry ass gaming Olympics. Mm -hmm. They have an Olympics for everything now. Yep. They sure Just do. go with it. The championships are everywhere. <laughs> and besides, I've worked it up that like getting to a million points this is like big ass thing, but like, you know, mm -hmm. there's some people out there who are like doing high score challenges and they get like four million points in this game. It's like, oh okay, all right. <laughs> Because they, like, loop the game twice over in, like, a single playthrough. Like, mm. oh, boy. Like, I'm not there yet. 
more practice. More PP. Yeah, that too. I think I'm going to make the tryptophan argument. It was the turkey we ate earlier. Oh, yeah. that's the that's the ticket. See, I'm half asleep playing mm -hmm. now, so yeah, it's affecting my my game. Yeah. Actually, though, I found in the arcades that like it was the days that like I'm between classes and I'm like half asleep and I play this game. Those are the days I would play the best. Probably because I was kind of zenning it, you know, like mm -hmm. if you're if you're consciously trying to like dodge everything, it's overwhelming. But when you just kind of like have your eyes half closed and you're like looking at the corner of the screen and you're just like Neo in the Matrix dodging everything out out of the corner of your eye, you know, like <laughs> that's usually when you do the best. I can see that. So it's kind of weird. Zen in the art of Raiden 2 playing. And yeah, you want to kind of get to where, like, a lot of the things you do are just muscle memory, you know? Mm-hmm. I think that's a misnomer. What do you mean? I understand what they're trying to get across with the idea of muscle memory, but it's not the muscle having the memory. No, 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 no. And I don't think that that's the intent. The intent is that um, it's the hypothalamus, it, I think. What it is is it's unconscious memory. Right, right. It is unconscious brain function. No, I, I will give you that it's poorly named, but, you know, I don't think there's much the confusion. The concept is valid, and, right. and it is a real thing. I totally understand what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Well, then I guess we understand what each other is saying, and we should probably stop arguing about it. No, goddammit. Oh, yeah, you're wrong. That's Shut right. Up. I am right. I mean, you're wrong, I'm right. Whatever. <laughs> No bonus. <laughs> no bonus? How are you going to get to a million points without bonus? So I, there's like an extra medallion you can uncover. And I don't... I have to like read if there's like a technique to make it reliable. I only get it like half the time. Mm. So it's kind of weird. And at the end of the level, it multiplies... Um, all the medallions you pick up by a thousand. Um for every bomb you have. So I usually end the first level with four bombs. So that means that last medallion is five hundred dollars for pick or five hundred points for picking it up and four thousand in bonus points. So it kinda helps if you can get it. Right. And then later levels, like there's one on at the end of every level after the boss, there's like a hidden medallion. And like some levels you might be ending with like six bombs, so that's worth like sixty five hundred to you. Right. So, you know, when you're trying for a high score, it kind of counts. Yep. I've been a little sloppy here. I'm, I haven't been paying that much attention sometimes, and sometimes there's an enemy I left behind that, like, I know they, I know where all these guys are going to come out, and I'm playing lazy right now. Like, I'm like, oh yeah, there's a guy there. <laughs> you know, <laughs> instead of being ready for it, you know. Right. On this version, this is one of the things that is tuned a little easier. This guy, once he gets to the spread shots, check this out. If you stay lined up with him, he'll always miss you. <laughs> so that's kind of cool. Right. Yeah, that doesn't work on the other version. <laughs> it's only after you blow up all the little guns. And now, like, if I stay centered here... He can't hit me if I'm far enough back. Mm -hmm. Damn it! I was dodging the tank shot and uh Oh well. Poo man. Your uh, I got the wrong missiles. Again. Shoot. Yeah, it's about the time I should switch also pretty soon, but eh. Maybe I'll stay with red this time. I don't know. Switch it next level. Darn it, man. 
I, I really shouldn't have let that happen. That was just bad playing. Bad playing. Bad playing. Yeah, seriously. Okay, can I get some of these guys? Oh, crap. That was too close. Okay. Homing. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. I'm feeling a little more confident now. I think I'm well outfitted for taking on the boss here. And I'll get to full power weapons next stage. There's another thing too though, score wise. After you're at full power for either the missiles or the uh, lasers. There are eight levels of lasers, four levels of missiles. After your max on any of those, any power-ups you pick up are 5,000 points each after that point. So that helps you get to a million points too. But mm. I've gone and screwed that up by dying. And now a lot of you know power-ups that would have just been points are going to be just to get back on my feet again. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Shouldn't have cut it that close. Come on, die. Please die. Hello? Die? Die? Can we die? Please die. Oh, I died. Never mind. <sighs> That's one of those things where the better weapons would have helped. Yeah. I would have gotten him before he got me. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, bonus metal and I don't even pick it up. This is going yeah. wonderful. So welcome to the gripe cast. You tuned mm. in to listen to me complain about how I'm doing. <laughs> but I tell you, these Egos productions have really gone downhill. Not that they were that great to begin with, but wow. Let's watch somebody play badly at Raiden. Oh, something to mention since last time. I remember complaining a little bit about this arcade stick. Because I'm like, dude, the switches are too clicky and they kind of like catch when you're trying to go diagonal sometimes. But I think it's one of those things that like you have to wear it in a little. Because mm. now it actually feels pretty good. But there were times before where like I'd be trying to push diagonal and it would get stuck going sideways. And it's like, well, you know, that doesn't help you stay alive. Right? <laughs> mm -hmm. But now it's like, it's fine. It doesn't ever get stuck in a position I'm not expecting it to be in. So I think those switches, like, the corners have to get rounded on them before it starts acting like you expect. That might even be true for, like, actual arcade games. Like, when they're fresh off the factory floor, the controls might be a little rigid. But, you know, because, like, when you play it, it's probably a well-worn stick already you know mm -hmm. so so that was me failing to get to a million points several times i don't know if i really want to do another or... <laughs> yes you do how we all feeling you want well to heck you it's want only bandwidth money. and yeah. storage in the cloud which doesn't add to the carbon footprint of anything <laughs> let's just go ahead and do it right all right we'll stream we'll stream as long as it takes as long as it no <laughs> But you need to play one more time. No, but really, one more. One and that'll more. be it. All right. I got warmed up. Now you I'm... You are. Now the cheese flowing. The cheese is flowing? I like it. Yeah. Let's see. That, maybe I can expand the game window a little. Oh, Go oh, Wisconsin. Uh-oh. What's happening here? It actually expanded on the uh, stream, too. That's kind of... Okay, one more. Whew. All right, got to remember where everything is. 
Where does the guy come out? There's one. So I thought that was interesting because I never really considered that perhaps an arcade stick needed to be broken in a little, mm -hmm. you know, because like the, these sticks have like Gemma parts, so they're like official arcade things, but th those parts can vary in quality too, you know. So at first I thought this might have been, because it's not, it's not by f any means the most money you can spend on an arcade stick, so I thought maybe they used cut rate parts. Right. But now that's broken in, I'm kind of like, you know what? It's good. It's like something you never hear from me. No complaints. I got no complaints. <laughs> For once in my life. Come on, people, read faster. So I haven't seen anyone really check in on Twitch, but I really don't have like a following on there, so no one's spoken up in the chat. I think I'm the only viewer, so hmm. you know. This might be one of those things people can catch after the fact. Maybe so. And I'm recording at local so I can put it on YouTube and whatever. Mm -hmm. Maybe even Facebooky. Yeah, this is a good sign, actually, for my chance of success, because I just looked at the screen and thought to myself, wait, I've been playing this whole time? Mm -hmm. Like, that's usually a good sign. That means I'm in the right zone, or, like, uh, I'm apparently not thinking about it too hard. Oh, oh, oh! I can't even explain what happened there. <laughs> that's that's a restart, though. Restart. Yeah. You can't croak on the first level and expect to be called a human being. Well, you on. know, just as a vicious viewer, <laughs> I have to say that because you thought you were doing so good and you right. said so, that the... Video games gods had to humble you so that you would play correctly the next time. True. But With, technically what happened, without though... Without saying you're doing good. Technically what happened is I got a little ahead of myself because I did start thinking about it. Like, that guy I'm supposed to be, like, up here on him so that when he goes into his firing mode, he doesn't turn the turret around. He mm -hmm. aims at me and fires where he can't hit. I was a little too high or a little too low. So the turret started spinning, then I'm like, oh crap, how am I going to go grab the metal? Yeah. And have him not fire at me, although maybe I should have just gone for it anyway. But but then the other tank shot me from the side when I was like deliberating what to do. So that he, was, he once again, bad gameplay. He who lost. Huh? He who hesitates is lost. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, you, you aren't given a lot of hesitation time in this game. All right. More bad gameplay from the Jors. That's super embarrassing to die on the first level. Ooh, like, come on. Fire and Blood came out. Good, good, good. Who? George R. R. Martin. Oh, the next delaying one. Delaying his saga once again by writing another book. Right. Has come out with that book, which... Now he'll have to think of some other way to delay. So is it the seventh book? No, that's what or I'm it's saying. It's the sixth. It's the sixth. No. No? No, he's not writing. He's oh. writing a, not, a separate book. It's oh, separate even, series. It, it's in the same world, but it's a different book. So that way, he's working on something else. So that way, his excuse of not writing the sixth book or finishing it is because he's writing this book. Oh, okay. He's finding ways not to finish his saga. So, but when Game of Thrones concludes, it's going to be, what, seven, seven. books? Okay. 
And so this is like not part of the seven book series though. Correct. But okay. still in the same world. Wow. Yep. That guy. Basically what in this he's going back farther and telling the full story of the things he's hinted about in Game of Thrones. Hmm. So it's like a prequel in a way. It's the Silmarillion. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There you go. That's what he's doing. Only it's not like a Bible, I would guess. Because nope. Silmarillion kind of comes out that way. Oh, a, this is just the first part of a two-part series. This is only the first volume, so he's still got another book to write. Really? Before he can get back to writing Game of Thrones. Shh. Wow. He's purposely trying to die before he finishes. <clears throat> he's, wait, he's waiting for it. Or what it, no, what it really is, he's probably written these books. They're already done. He doesn't want to hear what people are going to say about them. So he's letting them sit until he dies, and then they will be published. It's kind of true. The internet ruins everything. Yeah, it does. The, the internet and Adam. Yep, and yeah. Adam. They ruin everything. And, and when they combine, it's even worse. Right. Okay, see? Stay up on the turret so he fires forward. Thank you very much. Ugh. Yep. This is basic stuff, Mr. Jors. You're supposed to know this. <laughs> Jors should know this. Anyhow. Then I gotta rush up on this guy before he fires. You see, that was the problem. I started thinking about it just a little Stop bit. Stop thinking, Daryl. Yeah. No more thinking, just doing. The totally Yoda game. That's it. Play. Play not. Do not hesitate. There is no think, only do. Or something like that. Yeah, something like that. Hey, I got the bonus medal. That means I'm going to get my million He's points. He's got his boner! 60,000 points. I, that's the most you can get on single player. Go. For the bonus. He's got his secret medal. And then my total is 175,000, which isn't bad. Cool. Even if you get 100% kills, your score can be a little different because some of the medals are occasionally, like, ones that are worth 3,000 points when you pick them up. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, There's a little variance in scoring. And then sometimes you get the... Is he worth 5,000? There's like a little dragon, like kind of cartoon dragon you can pick up. But then you don't get the metal bonus at the end for picking one of those up. So it's just like a one-time score. And those just seem like they appear randomly where metals show up. I think those are worth 10, maybe. I can't remember right now. But basically, like, a typical metal times four bombs would be worth 4,500, so the 10,000 is actually a better thing to get. I could be wrong, though. Maybe it's only five. I don't remember. I know the uh, ferry is worth 10. Okay, I'm gonna sneak over here and get this. Metal? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Blow up, please. Thank you. I gotta get closer to train more fire on this guy. There we go. That's pretty good. There we go. That's how you're supposed to do that part. You're like, yeah, yeah. Excuse me while I'm on my phone for 45 minutes. <laughs> Did you say something? No, I didn't. Okay. And I wasn't directed at you at all. So, don't worry. Uh. Uh. I'm telling you, the flow is good this time. Other than me not picking up that power up yet for some reason. I'll be at full power once I do. 
then everything is going to be bonus points unless I die. Try not to die. I won't. Just watch. Okay, got the 5,000 points for the red. And the 5,000 points for... Oh, I was going to switch to purple, wasn't I? I guess I didn't do that. Oh, well. You said you might. Well, I kind of think that's my new strategy is like, actually, purple can take this guy down surprisingly fast. I don't know why. It seems like it's weak against almost everyone else. But... Anyway. I will attempt to do this. No bombs. We'll see how far I get. Oh, yep. Okay, actually, purple's no faster than that, so I'm good. I'll switch to purple before the end of the next stage. Hey, there it is. It was 10,000 for the little dragon. Cool. So basically, I'm going to get uh, 5,000 bonus for my five bombs. So getting a 10,000 that doesn't count toward that bonus is actually better. So cool. Yeah. 462,000 so far. I hope this game's as fun to watch as it is to play. Oh, I'm sure it is. <laughs> hey, that's true with like almost every game. It's I'm like, sure, yeah. Yeah. That's so much fun to watch. Actually, though, some games, like PUBG, I, I like watching people play it better than me playing it, because I like to watch someone who's actually good at it, <laughs> you know? I think that's probably true of most sport of any Right. Game. And since I'm still kind of, like, you know, in training with this game, it's like, you know, maybe if it's like I could play through the entire game without getting hit even once, that would be, like, something worth watching. But as is, seeing me, you know flub around and everything is eh, maybe not the best I don't know if anyone chooses to watch this at home let me know were you entertained were you bored are you not entertained <laughs> oh that guy was about to shoot and I was ready for it and then I didn't need to be Okay, purple, perhaps, when I get a chance that I'm not being shot at from 5,000 directions. Yeah, purple. Let's do it. Purple! Oh boy. Purple nurple, there it is! See, at least with the full-powered homing missiles, you can protect your sides a bit. Yeah. Without needing the red to spread out everywhere, so... Yeah. yeah, it kind of works. And the advantage of purple is it can target multiple things at once. So, like, when you get clusters of bad guys like these platforms, it takes them out really fast because if you're using any other kind of laser, you're only going to be hitting the front row. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I must be up in the front row. I didn't like going all the way to the edge of the screen there because I could have been trapped by someone shooting at an odd angle. Right. All right. And bonus points for purple. There we go. Nice. Yeah, like the purple is definitely weaker in this version of the game, but if you can switch to it when you're full power, being able to hit multiple items at once makes up for it being weak. Mm -hmm. So, like that guy got all the way down the screen. He wouldn't have if I had red lasers, but mm -hmm. oh well. So you just got to deal with it. Okay, so this boss coming up does give me trouble. I have to admit, so. I'm probably going to have to use bombs. But 
I don't know, last time I used purple, it was it was not the worst. I think I can handle this. Yeah. Got a time picking up that thing. There we go. Cool. Yeah, it's like all these little side cannons on this guy. Like you the purple can just like hit them all every time they pop out. Right. If you're using the other lasers, it's really hard to take out the side things. And then if all of them are firing at once while the main gun does this, it's really hard to dodge everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but like now, like almost all those guns are just destroyed. There's one more layer here, but hopefully I can just weather this out and, you know, destroy enough of those side guns before I get trapped. Oh god, that's a lot of shots. Whew. That can be rough to dodge sometimes. Holy cow. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I think... It... I, I was about to say I think I got it and ran right into that shot. So close. Oh! Oh! That hurts because I think that's going to make the difference between me getting to a million, perhaps... Dang, I was seconds away from destroying him. Close. Oh well. So probably if I make it to the end of this level, I'll have a million points. But that's a big if with two lives and limited weapons. Oh, a P. That means I get to P. Full power of everything. That's nice. Um, purple works well against these guys because they fire straight down the screen and you don't have to put yourself in the line of fire to damage them, so that's right. kind of nice. Oh boy. That is nice. Only I have the f forward firing missiles, which it's nice if you can hit them a little bit with that. Okay. I think I gotta switch to homing next opportunity. Homing, but getting to it at the right time is what I don't want to do is just rush up there and get shot because mm -hmm. I'm trying to pick up a power up. Yeah, right. right. It tends to happen. There we go. I got the 5,000 points for that one, and there's my homing. Okay, you just got to be patient for it sometimes. Now this game, just to be a jerk, throws in a bunch of, like, useless pylons that attract your purple laser and your missiles. So, arguably this isn't the best loadout for the stage because you basically wind up shooting all the pylons instead of the actual enemies, but I think I can make it work. And these guys, that little temple dude that came out there, yeah. they're a bitch! Look at their firing pattern, they keep shooting at you. Hmm. They take they take a lot of hits too. Okay, second fairy in the game. If I can get it. Wow, I didn't I didn't pop the fairy out? That's unbelievable. Oh boy. Alright, red lasers as it is. <laughs> My final life. Wow, that was Terribly bad. Oh. I think I was in so much disbelief about the fairy, I just like kind of stopped playing for a second. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, how can that be? Oh gosh! Did you see how close that was? Yep. <laughs> oh. The microphone was in the way. I thought the guy was I thought that guy was gone and he was still alive and continued firing, and I'm like, oh no, I'm like right next to him. Wow. That's the kind of dodging that, if you're thinking about it, just doesn't happen. <laughs> right. Oh, man. 894,000. 
And this is going to be a tough fight with the current loadout that I have, just being realistic here. Yeah, this is going to be a really tough fight. And also, a lot of these guys drop medallions, so I'm tempted to go get all the medallions, but then if I go too far over on the screen, they're going to be shooting sideways at me. So, right. so I just have to, like, deal with only getting some of the medallions because there's, like, too much shit flying at me. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm going to use bombs because, like... Otherwise, I don't know if I'm going to make it to a mill, you know? My bonus is going to suck. So, there's that. <gasps> that was so close. I thought that guy had me. Like, oh my gosh. That, like, literally took my breath away. <laughs> that came so close to my ship. thought for sure I was done. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Too many shots. <laughs> I can't see what's happening. Uh. Okay, stay largely in the center. Dodge the white shots. <laughs> and keep this guy at bay. Come on, die. Okay. I am going to clear a million at the bonus awesome. here. So Awesome. Fun. You did it. You don't see that happen very often around here. <laughs> cool. Cool. Yeah, my bonus sucks because I used all my bombs just to survive. That was one of those calls I had to make. Like, do yeah. I risk like dying right here and not hitting the million? Or should I just go all out and make sure I get to it? Yeah. You know? Right. So yeah. Worked out. That's cool. Well, let's see how far past a million I can get now. I do kind of miss the days, though, when I would get this far without dying, but, you know, not quite there yet. Like, it happens once in a blue moon now, but... I have a good loadout for this level, so I'm feeling good about that. No bombs, though, so if I have an oh crap moment, I'm done, you know. Yeah. I'm trying to think of if anyone's coming up that I really need to use a bomb against, and I don't. I think only the end boss. All these other guys are kind of. I'm gonna like not go all the way to the side of the screen here though, because there are a bunch of tanks I can get you, and I just don't have the firepower to clear them all. So. Got to pick your battles sometimes. Man, that level 4 boss was hairy. Several times, like, I just got lost in all the shots coming at me, and I'm like, I hope I survive. <laughs> yeah. But that was a lot of crap shooting at me. Like, these bosses after a while are just insane, you yeah. know. Especially if you're not at, like, full firepower. Right. Oh, I've got a bomb now. Uh, may come in handy. Yeah, this guy here is a bit of a, an obstruction, but didn't need to use a bomb on him. But you have all these little guys flying down the screen, and then he does a, sh a stream of shots that block your shots. And then it's hard to clear the airborne guys on one side of the screen when he's shooting. Mm hmm There's just all kinds of stuff in this game that'll mess you up. It's like someone designed it that way. You would yeah. think that. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. That little juke there almost cost me my life. I didn't think the guy was ready to fire. Eh, stuff like that keeps happening. Okay, these guys, if they both fire at the same time, that can be bad news. But being at full firepower, I was able to straighten them out pretty quick. So level 5 boss is coming up. I'm not really sure how this is going to go. 
he's a pretty durable boss. You can. He's got a lot of stages. Like you blow him up once, twice, three times. You know, he keeps coming back. So. Right. Like this is his first form, which is kind of. I don't know what's going on here. Like he's trying to take off. Yep. Oh! <laughs> that was way closer than it needed to be. And this guy, I think, just has a timer. Like, it doesn't matter how many times you shoot him, he just blows up eventually. Mm -hmm. And then here's the new form. The A hole inside that you gotta. Yeah, so, like, the story in this game isn't really explicit, but I think these are all supposed to be aliens. And this is like their ship trying to escape after you've kind of decimated their um, forces on Earth. Because then the next stage you go into space and then you're attacking their, like, home asteroid or whatever. Here's another one. Stay centered there and he misses. Whoa. And then he's a little off center and he misses. So when he's high on the screen, you center up with him. And if he's midway down the screen, you go a little off center. And then this part, you just. Oh! You just die. <laughs> I had the wrong kind of bomb, and I forgot. Oh. I was trying to hit him with the cluster bomb. Oh well. So, what yeah. was the score? 1,191,780. One yep. So cool. Yep, you got it. Million point challenge successful! <laughs> Yay. <laughs> you know, I need to go to Party City before one of these so I can, you know, have streamers and, you know, I don't know. All right, everybody. At least balloons. Yeah. All right, I'm going to give uh, Leafy over there the um, right to sign off. Go ahead and take us out. Tell, tell everyone where you can find us and everything. You can find us on Incoherent Ramblings or, in this case, Ecos Live. No, we didn't even turn on all the lights. Did we That's not? That's how easy we are. <laughs> oh my god. Like you're, you're kind of like in the dark and all. I'm in the dark all the time here. Like, look, look, ladies and gentlemen, this is how good. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is how good the lighting could have been. Yes, could have been, <laughs> but was not. But somebody forgot to turn on half the lights. You would think that they would remember that shit, but. <laughs> And right. they get so involved in the game, they don't remember. Absolutely right. Okay. So, bye. bye All right. Egos.live, check it out. Here's my logo. Boom. Laters.